Hey y'all, coming to you from the International Headquarters, Scotty DTV, but I was at the 2022 NSRA Street Rod Nationals in Louisville, Kentucky, and I came across this very cool 1938 Divco I think y'all are gonna like. Let me get the camera turned around, we'll check it out. Man, I'm a fan of these. Old wore out milk trucks, ice cream trucks, whatever they delivered, who cares? They deliver cool nowadays. In this one, you can look close and still see the original lettering on it. Laying on the ground, great wheel choice. Do not touch that patina. That patina is perfect. And wait till you see inside this thing. It will blow your mind. This was one of those, have you seen? You know, Scotty, what's cool? Have you seen that Divco? That thing is way cool. And again, I think that, you know, people miss. They look and they see all that rust and they think, ah, oh, you know, that's just an old wore out truck but I promise you it's not information I have is it's got a 5.3 in it truck motor again it was one that I was trying to set up uh, interviews on but wasn't able to put it together I apologize for that but um, man it was one of my favorites of the whole show I mean I'm just a huge fan of this thing look at that how crazy is that Man, I'm a fan. This is, I mean, I would keep this thing forever. I would never, never have a reason to sell it. This, When this pulled up, you'd know it was me and Piddle arriving. Even when I was 70 and she was 20. That roof is crazy cool. There isn't anything I would change on this. Like I said... I think this is just as cool as any hot rod, any high dollar hot rod you put together. Again, you hear me say it all the time, there gets to be a level of cool where you can have something different, but it's not more cool than whatever's next to it. And I think the wheel choice is good for this. I think leaving the patina, you know, Mother Nature gave it the perfect paint job. And then to do that incredible work on the inside, holy smokes, man. I am a fan. It was at the Ride Tech booth at the 2022 NSRA Street Rod Nationals in Louisville, Kentucky. And uh, one that I was sure glad I got to shoot a video of and excited to bring it to y'all and see what you think of it. Because I am just blown away. There again, I know how much work is, it takes to do all that. And I can't even imagine. I mean, the, the, the person that did that has more talent in their fingernail than I have in my whole body just crazy cool because it's not me able to just be able to pull it off it's knowing how to do it and make it look cool and make it work and make people say wow taste talent and money right that's what it takes to uh, have a cool hot rod and it doesn't hurt when they're laying on the ground Very cool for sure. Like I said, a ton of work in something that looks like it doesn't have anything done to it. So there you go from the 2022 NSRA Street Rod Nationals, a 1938 Divco. How cool is that? Hope y'all have enjoyed it. See ya! Hey y'all, make sure you subscribe to this channel and visit scottydtv.com for an easy way to search the hundreds of videos I have posted. Either click the link in the description or the one at the end of this video.